So if you're pregnant and you're getting low back pain, join the club. Lots and lots and lots of women around the world get low back pain when they're pregnant. And it's a bit tricky because you're kind of limited to what you can do to relieve your low back pain, especially at home. You can't always do the same exercises as before. But a really great one is if you have a therapy ball at home, just sitting on top of it, pop your hands on your hips, and I want you to imagine your pelvis as a fishbowl. And can you just rock the water from the front of your fishbowl to the back of your fishbowl? So you're kind of tilting your pelvis forward and then tilting it backwards. Now you'll probably have a big tummy, so your range will be a bit restricted, but you'll still be able to do this movement. So if you look in from the side, you can see that my hips, when I rock one way, I march in my back, and when I go the opposite way, I'm tucking in my tummy. So just doing about 10 of those to try and loosen up your lower back. And then you can also doing some, do some tilting from side to side. So again, your pelvis is a fishbowl and we're rocking the water out the sides of our fishbowl. And you should hopefully feel this in your lower back. And let's pretend we've done about 10 to each side. And then we're going to do some circles. So some really large circles, rocking the water all the way around the outside of our fishbowl. And we can do 10 one way, and then we'll do 10 in the other direction. And that's a really nice way you can just loosen up through your lower back when you're pregnant, and it's quite safe to do through your whole pregnancy. Now, if you're getting tight in your upper back, a really good one is our mermaid stretch. So popping one hand on the ball, and then just stretching over with your fingers and relaxing and the other side. And we're thinking about really elongating through this side, not collapsing and crunching down, but trying to grow tall as we stretch over. And we'll get a bit fancy, let's breathe in. And then as we breathe out, we'll stretch over and you should be able to get a little further as you exhale. So we'll breathe in and reach up and then breathe out as we stretch over. And we should be feeling it down here. We're just trying to get some mobility in through our upper back. We'll do one more on this side. And then we'll just pop our hands across our chest, take a big breath in and as we breathe out, twisting our body around and breathing and breathing out, twisting right around and breathing in. And again, this one is to loosen up through our upper back. And you can also do this one sitting on a chair, so nice ones to do when you're at work. And we'll just finish up on this side. Try and exhale as you twist, and inhale as you return. 